Welcome to another training session, uh, Computer Tutoring. This time we're going to look at managing digital signatures. Now if you've looked at the previous video, you can see I've already signed this document. So I want to manage this certificate, maybe send it to somebody else. So what I can do here is if I go to Edit, and then go down to Preferences, and then make sure from the Categories lift list on the left-hand side, I select T Signatures, and then click More in the Identities and trusted certificates section. So here we can see my digital ID file is here. This one here is from a Windows certificate store. In fact, just to emphasize the point, I'm just going to expand digital ID files on the left hand side and click on Simon PFX here. That's just identifies or focuses in on our, my local uh, signature. So say for instance now what I want to do is send this to somebody else so they can validate my documents. So I click on export here at the top. And I'm going to, rather than email the data to a file, I'm going to save the data to a file. I'm going to click on Next. And here's my, um, uh, this is where I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it on my desktop. In fact, here's one I've already got, Cert Exchange Simon Cubbin FDF. So I'm going to click on Save. Yes, to replace existing file. And then it's saved and it's exported. So this is how you export uh, the digital signature and then you will email or meet in an underground car park somewhere passing it on a USB stick which is within a locked briefcase or something secure so you know that the person has safely got your certificate and nobody else has tampered with it. Thanks very much for watching. Please watch for more Adobe Acrobat videos on our website.